All right, I'm going to give this one to uh, Mary for first take. This is from Roger B., who says, uh, predicts Walker will re revisit his stance on granting pardons. There's too much money available from us ex-cons. I was 17, <laughs> 47 years ago, and committed a burglary. Isn't it time that I and others were deemed worthy by our governor-elect? Now, uh, we saw the pardon thing come up just in the Stephen Avery thing this week when the Skywalker's not given nope. any pardons, right? No. Nope. Do you see any change no in pardons. that? I don't see a difference. I, I think that he's pretty much took office saying, I'm not doing pardons, and I think, he's not I think he doing. decided the potential for that to blow up is much greater than any good that comes from it. Weighed that and said, I don't want to do it. Not even making a murderer can change his mind. All right, and we have one that came in from Go Packers. This is, a, this is more of a question. It says, what do you think, who do you think might be the next Democratic for governor in Wisconsin? So we're a little ahead. This is more of a 2018 prediction, I guess. But who, who do you think you see out there, uh, Dan, is on the Democratic side who could Well, no one saw Mary Burke running at yeah. this far out. Um, it, to tell you the truth, I have no idea who would be. Uh, Ron Kind is someone who's discussed frequently, but he's one of those who ends up discussing it, thinking about it, and not ever running for anything but his current seat. Um, I'm not sure. Uh, well, you've okay. got a you've got, got a Dan's Democrat Tom that has Christian, go for it. Well, it's not going to be yeah. Tom Barrett. Yeah, I can tell you that. <laughs> you've got a Democrat that has one statewide. For so, so for that reason, I'll just say Tammy Baldwin. Yeah, Let's I, go with that. I don't see I don't see Tammy running. All right, you got a name for uh, us, Mary? I probably not. Um, you know, I think again they might try to go uh, from some somebody from the private sector because they just have a pretty thin bench when it comes to uh, people you know who are elected now who can win statewide. And the other leaders, I mean, do you do? you know, Peter Barca, I mean, those sort of um, legislative leaders, but there's no one to inspire. I mean, the other the other name that we didn't discuss is Chris Abley. If he wins the election now, there's been a lot of talk that he's interested in running eventually. Um, and he would be a different sort of mm -hmm. candidate since he has been more of a fiscal conservative, social liberal, fiscal conservative as Milwaukee County. But, you know, he, he has a number of liberals who don't like him. Um, so, but uh, he would be my wild card. He does have money too, so that yeah. helps.